Hello Nuggets, it's your favorite TT from Divine Me 1111 Spiritual Guidance. I hope you all are doing well. We are going to get into the energies for this week for Leo. As I was getting ready to turn on the camera for you all, I heard Luda. So if you're listening to Ludacris, hi. Maybe that's a confirmation for you. I don't know. Anywho, um, Leo. Thank you all so much for your support. I appreciate you. Um, if you want to book a personal, the information is in the description box. $25 for 30 minutes, $55.55 for an hour. All right. Your channeled song for this week, and I think I've gotten this for you guys a couple of times. So, and it would be very much a Leo thing to, to, to do this. So it's Daft Punk one more time. Um, you don't give up. You're going to continue to, uh, I'm hearing fight the good fight. So congratulations with that Leo. Do what it makes, what makes sense to you, what makes you happy. Um, just don't fuck with other people. That's all I got. All right. Let's get some TT music or, and, and hold on, because I'm going to go back, because that was unfair. Don't let other people fuck with you. All right. So, our TT music oracle messages for Leo for this week. Moon Energy's got me a couple of days off, so by all means, it was not my heart but i love y'all i still have to make sure that i am energetically sound before i just start spewing stuff i don't play that i don't play with god like that all right so we have never gonna get it by invoke respect by aretha franklin on My Mind by Georgia Smith and Predator. Under the deck, we have Bed of Roses by Bon Jovi. I already 100% know that if it's, if, if it's not dealing in or involving respect, Leo ain't playing it. They ain't going for it. It is what it is. You gonna respect me or you gonna get the fuck away from me? Period. Any Leo I've ever known. So that's the first message I'm getting from that. Um, for others of you, you are seeing something, someone, place, space, energy for what it is. Your um, we've been talking about this for a couple of weeks now with. Um, your spiritual gifts uh, coming online uh, for some of you you're creating channels for others of you your your spiritual gifts are heightening whatever that is um, it does not have to do with uh, um, a spiritual job or calling per se it is whatever it is that you do naturally that you enjoy that you are good at that is what is uh, what your spiritual gift is and that is what is increasing so whatever that is you're getting an upgrade you're getting a spiritual download which means uh, you're learning more, your, um, your gifts are expanding, your territory is expanding, all right? Um, for some of you, something that you've uh, been working on um, may have hit a snag, and you are determined to press forward any anyway so um
some someone something anything trying to discourage or deter or take from you what is yours it's not happening all right you worked for what you have and you're going to keep it so don't worry about that no worries all right no worries messages for leo for this week Okay. Guys, please do like, share, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate it. Okay? We have card number 61. Turkey Spirit, give with gratitude and grace. It came out in the reverse. So, this is either you or someone else needing to be more grateful or um, showing more grace and gratitude either towards you or towards someone else um this is very much um coming in with that respect from by miss aretha franklin okay um just being mindful of of what you have being mindful of what you have um being mindful of how you got it okay giving grace and gratitude okay this is not just giving um you being given grace but you also giving grace giving gratitude being thankful for what is in your life who is in your life where you are giving grace and, th and being thankful for your journey where you're at right now all right um, card number 12, Canary Spirit. Sing your own song. Not only singing your own song, but allowing others to sing theirs. Okay. But singing your own song, being on your own. Uh, very, this, I know, I know, this is so uncouth. But being on your own dick. That's what I heard. That's what I had to say. All right. We have Badger Spirit, card number four, being fearless and bold. Card number 31, Groundhog Spirit, time to let go. So, uh, yeah, we have seven, three, four, four under the deck. <clears throat> We have card number 42, Otter Spirit, you are never alone. Um, be this you getting with people in your 3D realm or you um, realizing and recognizing and getting in more contact with, um, with God, with your spirit guides, with your, uh, um, with your higher self you are realizing and recognizing that you're not by yourself you're never alone it may feel like it but you are not and embracing that enjoying that understanding that and in doing so and you being more grateful and showing more grace and gratitude uh to yourself and to others it frees you up into um singing your own song marching to the beat of your own drum okay um accepting yourself for who you are where you are and giving your self more chances giving others uh more chances those who deserve to be in your life and a part of your journey and for others you know for for whatever that that is for you you are um taking things into your own hands and so with with doing that whatever needs to be let go is being let go whatever um you are needing to make room for you are surrendering to that you are being your feisty bold courageous um digging my heels in self i like that 
I like that a whole lot. But it is it starts with grace and gratitude. That is the place that where all of this fearlessness and walking in your own um I'm hearing walking in your own shadow. So let's see what that means. Let's see. Walking in your own shadow. For some of you, this is um, seeing the shadow part of yourself, that, that's, that side of yourself that you don't want others to see. Um, and we all have it. We all have those things that we, that we don't put forth, that we don't put out there. But... Um, you are balancing that, learning to balance that, learning to see where that comes from, and then being able to uh, integrate it somehow to where it is not um, detrimental to yourself and therefore detrimental to those in your environment around you. Being strong in singing your own song being your own cheerleader okay starseed oracle messages for leo for this week withdraw is something that i'm hearing so if you need to withdraw you're doing it for you know your own peace of mind for others of you, this could be someone withdrawing themselves from you because you may be in your shadow. You may be walking in your shadow and others are um, seeing that or feeling that from you and they are withdrawing. So take that how it applies, okay? Um, Ha, we have trust the timing. Take a listen to the um, to the general message. There's a, there could be a message in there for you. This was the first card in that. Trust the timing. Trust the wave you came in on. Time is not running out. It is never too late to be kind. It is never too late to um, show grace and gratitude. It's never too late for that. Uh, I am hearing it's too late to apologize by One Republic, but I, I don't think it is um, that harsh of a walking away and a cut and dry for some. Um, but for others, it could very well be, okay? But that is, that is a part of the being and allowing between yourself and, and someone else, okay? All right, we have your life is a canvas, artist, manifestation, create, uh, creative accountability. So whatever it is that you have woven or you have created, be it with your shadow or with your light, take it how it applies, you are recognizing that you have been the one to create whatever this is that's going on within you or around you. As within, so without, I am hearing. As above, so below. All right, we have baby steps. Action, follow your intuition before it makes sense. Whatever these nudges are, whatever it is that you are being called to uh, be fearless and bold about and to let go of whatever these uh, inhibitions are that are keeping you from um, being your true authentic self you are um, following those small those still small voices those those intuitive nudges to um, get you where you actually do want to be under the deck we have star bathing light body crystal grid transmission activation a lot of activation a lot of movement a lot of action um you are also being mindful now of it of it taking two to tango 
being mindful that um, take of, of taking responsibility and accountability for your part in something and not just the the part of you know whoever is around you um it's it's this this energy of no longer this tit for tat back and forth but also just being very transparent um being aware of your energy your light body being aware of um how you use your your energy your frequency your voice your time everything you are being very mindful of that um and if you are not this is what you're being called to do this week in order to um move things forward as you would see them uh for some of you this is completely starting anew um with whatever whatever it is that you're working on at this time um working on not just uh the respect of yourself and being demanded being demanding of of others respecting you but also you um realizing and recognizing that other people deserve the same respect that you yourself demand Woo! And if that is not what you're doing right now, if you are in this energy of uh, your shadow, that it's very much becoming a mirror. It's very much showing you, uh, showing you you. All right. Confirmation right there. All right. So we have, ooh, okay. We have the magician. Having everything you need to do whatever it is that needs to be done, but doing so from a place of grace, gratitude, um, loving, understanding, and also divine timing. Listening to divine timing. Uh, Ten of Cups. So we have Magician, Ten of Cups, and Lovers. And that is all about you being the creator of what you wish to have in your life. You choosing every single day you choose your either you're going to be in your light energy or you're going to be in your shadow energy it is a choice you have the um you have everything you need to do what it is that you choose, wish to do to create the the love place space environment to um to your highest frequency or your lowest that is what you are um, being brought to awareness of this week strength card absolutely taming that uh, taming the beast um, being gentle enough and strong enough at the very same time to I'm not going to say hold your tongue or hold your space or hold yourself back but um, I'm, I'm hearing the gambler by um, Kenny Rogers we had that the, the other day for one of our channel songs um Knowing when to hold them, when to fold them, when to walk away, when to run. All right. This is a lot of, um, this is a lot of spirit energy. You are very much uh, being transformed. Renewing yourself, renewing some uh, relationships and letting go of others. Queen of Pentacles and the Star, whatever it is that you've been engaging in, working on, nurturing, um, is very therapeutic and healing. You are mending some, I'm hearing mending some bridges um, 
for others of you, this is letting go of fears of uh, accomplishments. Woo. Hey, that's what's up. Under the deck, three of pentacles. Whatever it is that you had been uh, working on, sewing into, whatever it is that was... Uh, for some of you, this was you needing to... Uh, walk away from a, either a job or a, uh, uh, for some others of you, I'm getting third party situation. It doesn't have to be um, uh, romantic in nature or sexual in nature. This could be anything that was taking you away from the things that you love, the things that you um, enjoy the things that you are trying to build upon whatever that is you are healing it and releasing it for some of you this is mending some uh, mending some some things with uh, either a mother figure or a, a feminine energy this could be within yourself take it how it applies okay all right, Leos, I am going to leave it there. That is a really good space and place. Energies and signs that you could be dealing with at this time. Virgo, um, Aquarius, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Aries, another Leo, and Gemini. Okay, um, a lot of this seems to be happening like right now. I'm getting a right now kind of energy, okay? All right, Nuggets, I love you. I love you from my soul, and I send you all blessings and light. Take care.